all right everybody welcome to the channel tech guy charlie here so the other day someone asked how do you sign a word document like this using the s pen i mean you can actually sign a microsoft word or a pdf document using the s pen and this method is arguably more convenient than signing on a piece of paper and then scanning the signature using a scanner and finally adding the scanned image to word or a pdf document which believe it or not most people actually still do so quite a few steps involved isn't it now before we start one important thing to keep in mind is that we are going to create an electronic signature that is like your handwritten signature but in soft document which you can also print or send via email and this is different from a digital signature which validates your identity using cryptographic keys. But that's a topic for another video. So let me show you how it is done and we are gonna cover both Microsoft Word and PDF. So let us start with Microsoft Word. You can start by creating a new document on your phone or on your PC or you can start with a document that someone has sent you over email. For demonstration, I have created a new document on a PC and then sent it over to my phone. Okay, so now we have to open the document on the phone. For this, you can use the Office 365 app, which comes pre-installed on many Samsung smartphones, or use the standalone Word app, which you can download from the Play Store. We are gonna open the document in the standalone Word app, but the procedure is the same for Office 365. So once you've got the document open, take the S Pen out and tap on the edit button. Then tap on this small arrow button to open more options. And from here, you want to select the drawing tools. So tap here and select draw. Now you can see all of the drawing tools are disabled. This is because we have created this document on a PC and we have to select the print layout to enable the drawing tools. In most cases, the phone will automatically tell you that this document contains ink, shapes, to see them switch to print layout. But if you don't get this prompt, go back and then go back again and select print layout from over here. And there you go. Now you can tap on edit go back into the drawing tools and you will see that the drawing tools are now available for use. So from here, all you have to do is select the pen option and pick the desired color you want the signature to be in. And then sign the document. And if you feel like, you can also zoom in to make things easier. And there you go. That is pretty much all there is to it. And once you have signed the document, make sure that you save it. So check it out. This is how it looks like on a PC in Microsoft Word. And this is how it looks like when you take a printout of it. Looks awesome, right? So yeah, this is how you sign a Word document using the S Pen on a Samsung Galaxy smartphone. Now, as for PDFs, there are two apps that you can use to sign. So you can choose to open the document in Adobe Reader, which by the way does not come pre-installed on the phone. So you will have to download this from the Play Store. But signing documents in Adobe Reader is extremely easy. Yes, easier than MS Word. So all you have to do is tap on fill and sign, then tap on the signature option and select add signature. Then sign here and this will save the signature in Adobe Reader. So you can add your signature to any other document. So once you are done, just add the signature to the document just like this and then resize accordingly. Once you are done, save the PDF. And once again, this is how it looks like on a PC and this is how it looks like on a physical document. And because Adobe Reader saves your signature, you can sign any other document whenever you want to by following these same instructions. So that is awesome because you don't have to sign again and again. Now, if you don't want to download the Adobe Reader, then you can use the built-in Samsung Notes app to sign the PDF document. So launch the Samsung Notes app and then tap on the PDF button and then locate and open the document that you want to sign. And once you open the document, you should see this screen. And also you can see that it is already in the editing mode. But if you don't have any drawing options or any options down here, tap on the book icon to get out of the reading mode. Then you will see the editing options down over here. 
So all you have to do is tap here to enter into the drawing mode, then tap here to select the pen and the color of the ink. Make sure that you adjust the thickness according to your liking and then sign the document the way you would on an actual piece of paper. Finally, once you have finished signing the document, make sure that you export the file as a PDF so that you can send it over via email or print the document. And once again, this is how it looks like on the PC and this is the printout. You know what? It looks shockingly realistic as if it has been signed using an actual pen. Also, this is not my real signature. It would be pretty stupid to show my real legal signature on social media. So yeah, the signature is not real, but this is how you can use the S Pen on Samsung Galaxy Note S23 and the S22 Ultra to sign a Word or a PDF document. And with that, we have come to the end of the video. And if this video was helpful, make sure to hit the thumbs up button because that helps out a lot. And subscribe to the channel if you enjoy watching tutorials on Samsung Galaxy smartphones. I've got a ton of tutorials on the channel, so do check them out. Alright guys, so this is Tech Guy Charlie, signing off.